Many are planning to spend part of their Memorial Day weekend on the water. It will be a busy couple of days on area lakes. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen has some important tips to make sure you stay safe. Memorial Day marks the start of boating season. We want people to enjoy their weekend, you know, and relax. And we realize that along with that, you know, people do come out here, they bring alcohol and, and you know, they drink out here. Make sure you have a designated driver. TWRA District Boating Officer Josh Landrum says people need to drink responsibly. We are out here in full force on these holiday weekends and we do enforce our BUI laws and you know, we, we may stop you and ask you to perform some field sobriety tasks if we uh, feel that you might be impaired. Don't forget to equip your boat with a fire extinguisher, a throw pillow if your vessel is over 16 feet long, and of course life jackets for every person. They have to be in good working order and be in good condition with no uh, holes or tears in them. Also, life jackets must fit the passengers on board. If you have children, any child 12 and under has to be wearing a life jacket at all times uh, while the boat is underway. Lastly, make sure your boat registration is up to date and on your boat at all times. That's another thing that we look for. So those are just typically what an officer is going to ask uh, from you if you end up getting uh, stopped by one of our officers out here. While the TWRA wants you to have fun on the water, they also want boaters to stay safe on Memorial Day. Reporting from Percy Priest Lake, Alexander Cohen, News Channel 5. According to the TWRA, alcohol is a leading contributing factor to the majority of boating accidents.